Aloha and mahalo for joining me. I'm Janin and thank you so much for taking the time to be here and you know listen to the things that I'm sharing and I want to continue this journey and so I hope actually that you have been able to be on this journey with me. On Monday I invited you to come on this journey with me to fulfill a dream that you have and a dream that maybe you um, buried deep down inside you know as life got in the way um, for many of us and so I wanted to help you to be able to make those dreams come back and come alive and fulfill the dreams that you have so I hope you took me up on this invitation and have been with me so today is the third day and I want to invite you to think about the things that I'm sharing and really take into consideration you know how you can apply it in your life and and work um, towards a dream and so today's step so it would be the third step um, and it would be about your thoughts Okay, now this is a super interesting topic, I think, because, you know, our thoughts pretty much create our reality. And, you know, when you want to fulfill a dream, it's, it got, and if you were one of those that you buried it, you know, usually it's the thoughts that you have that have caused you to bury your dreams in the first place. And this is what I've heard a lot things like oh yeah you know what well it's just gonna have to wait because you know I have to work or I have to take care of my kids or I have to do this or I have other obligations right so these are the thoughts that you're thinking and you know everyone has a different journey here on earth right but if you can pay attention to your thoughts that is what's gonna really help you to move forward so um, be aware of what you're thinking, what you think on a daily basis. Like I talk about this all the time, right? I want you to first thing in the morning, write down all the things that you're thinking as soon as you wake up, because when you do write it down, you'll really be um, surprised at what's going on in your thoughts. Okay. Are you thinking thoughts that are positive or negative? Um, let me see what do you need to be thinking to move towards your dream so think about that are you having thoughts that are going to move you towards your dream or or not uh let's see okay so thoughts are powerful okay and your mind is one of the most powerful assets that you have and um you know everything starts with a thought everything you have starts with a thought to get you to where you have it now everything you don't have that you've wanted like a dream started with a thought right like I was explaining how we think like oh yeah I have to do everything else in the world first before I can fulfill my own dreams right and I've thought about that before too like Yesterday, I shared about how I had a dream to go to Italy, like more than 25 years ago. And, you know, I thought, oh, you know, I, I can't do it now. I can't afford it. I have a lot of little kids and, you know, I, I work and on and on and on and on. But I kept talking about it and I kept thinking about it. Anytime I would have a... <clears throat> excuse me, a conversation with someone about travel, I always would talk about how much I want to go to Italy. Okay, but I never did anything about it up until almost two years before I actually went, right? That's when I got into action and all of that. But prior to that, I had all these thoughts that, you know, weren't allowing me to work and move towards my dream. And, you know, everybody has their own dreams right but that was the one dream that I've had the longest that took me the longest to achieve which is kind of crazy because 
if I had known what I could have done, I could have gone to Italy way, way sooner, way long ago, instead of, you know, waiting 25 years later from when I first wanted to go. But, you know, it's okay. I finally went and it was amazing. It was everything I had dreamt of and more. So that's what I hope to help you accomplish is to be able to, you know, work up to what you want to um, do and, and the dreams you want to fulfill and, and all the things that can help you get there. And it's about the things that you learn along the way as well. This is like what I keep talking about. It's who you're becoming as you work towards any dream it doesn't matter and no dream is too small or insignificant no matter what your dream is it's important and it should be considered big for you and you know if you think it's too small and not not have any meaning you're less likely to actually work towards it right because your thoughts are always going to get in the way um, when you think that, oh yeah, my dream is too small, it doesn't matter, and nobody's going to care. But you know what, those are the things that aren't going to help you come alive. And that's one of the things that I'm strongly encouraging you is to find something that's going to make you come alive when you wake up first thing in the morning. Okay, because we need something to get us excited about when we wake up instead of going through the daily grind and I talk about this a lot right um, there are times in in our lives where we get up and we do the same thing over and over and over and it just becomes a grind and we're not enjoying life and you know we're unhappy now there may be people out there who haven't experienced that but for myself and many other people who I've talked to over the years have gone through all of that same cycle and so that's why I'm here. I want to be able to help you make that dream come alive. What's in your heart? You know, I always mention that God usually puts these dreams in our hearts for a reason. Okay, and you need to bring it out. You need to fulfill these dreams no matter what it is. Okay, now there's endless things that um, are, are possible to achieve. Okay, but... But the most important thing I want you to be aware of is your thoughts because your thoughts are going to either help you fulfill your dreams or not. Okay, so like I, I just said that your thoughts are probably or is the most powerful asset that you have, right? You got to remember that your mind is where your thoughts come from and you know, try to pay attention and be aware throughout the day, like what you're thinking. And usually sometimes when you're thinking things, it can kind of stress you out too. So pay attention to that. You know, we, like I, I mentioned, like we have a dialogue, we have a conversation with ourselves every day throughout the day. And I can guarantee that some of that is not really positive or helping you. Okay, so your first first thing I want you to do in the morning is to write all your thoughts down, what's going on, pay attention to it. So if you haven't had a chance to watch yesterday's video, I want you to be able to go back and watch it because I give you many ways on how you can stay focused on your dream. Okay, you have to remember you are important and you have worth and value. Okay, so those are some of the things that I wanted to talk to you about is your thoughts. Okay, everything starts with a thought. Everything that you see in the world started with a thought. Every creation started with a thought here on earth, right? Because can you imagine if those people who, you know, like for example, electronics, if nobody who um created electronics you know if they didn't go with a thought that they had to try something out and to to create this and see what would happen we wouldn't have all the electronics we have now i love electronics i love technology and i'm so happy 
that these people who had these thoughts actually went with it and started creating and working on on these things that they were thinking about so remember always always remember your thoughts are going to either create your reality for good or it's going to create your reality for negative okay so it is possible for you to fulfill your dreams but you have to pay attention really be aware okay and i hope you can take this time to do this and you know please share this video who you know somebody could use it and get great value out of it do you know someone out there who has a dream they want to fulfill but they have never done it or they put it aside like I know people who have and so I want you to be able to share this video and then that way you know people can actually have something so exciting to live for and come alive right the world needs people to come alive now and to fulfill their dreams and you know there's so much going on that if we all make an effort to live our dreams and and just come alive you know this world would be a much better place much much better all right so if you have any questions you let me know please leave a comment and i would love for you to share in the comments if you have a dream that you want to fulfill and if you have any questions please let me know but i am so grateful that you take the time to be here and and watch um, what i'm sharing and you know this is important for me to help other people and especially women to be able to fulfill their dreams and come alive you know it just makes life so much better when we can focus on doing something good so take this time for you today and think about your thoughts and if you need help you let me know please send me a direct message i'm i'll be more than happy to answer your questions and and i hope you have a great day aloha